Hey, what's going on guys? Today we're playing a custom map on World at War called Snowblind. It is a Austrian concentration camp, I believe. Something to that effect, like a POW camp. And the story behind it is that the Germans left it after World War II. And I don't fucking know, but it looks really cool. It's got really awesome perks in it, apparently. And it's got World at War guns, so I really can't wait to play this. Um... Okay, so this is my first playthrough of this map. Now the music seems a bit intense, which is pretty cool. Um, okay, here we go. Just relearning my controls on PC because, uh, well not relearning, just remembering what I had set them to. Because I'm playing World at War on PC in a while. Okay, 1958 in Austria. So yeah, I was right. After World War II in Austria. I don't know what it's supposed to be. It kind of reminds me of Call of the Dead in a way. Um, it looks really awesome though. The HUD. The HUD's better than the fucking Cold War and Black Ops 4 HUDs. The Cold War HUD's not terrible, but... Just... The Black Ops 2 era of HUDs, the Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3 era of HUDs were just... Different, man. They were just so much cleaner and nicer. Like, this is a World at War HUD, but it looks so good. Now, I'm a big fan of the blue-eyed zombies. I think they look really cool. Um... Jeez. M14 starting wall, but I haven't had that in a long, long time. And the reason why I like World at War Zombies, uh, especially custom zombies on World at War, is the fact that it's so pure to itself. It's what zombies is supposed to be. No bullshit, just straight shooting and <laughs> shooting zombies. <laughs> There's a bit of realism in it. A bit, I said. There is still perk machines and other things. That is really cool. That's a barrel wall, wall barrier. Can I rebuild it? Oh man, the barrier's built out of barrels, that's kind of sick. Okay, let's head on up. Now, I only bought the M14 because I was good. Is that an Origins generator? Please tell me it isn't, because I won't fucking survive. But it is. Fuck. Okay, so there is Templar zombies, lovely. They're gonna make my life a living hell. <laughs> oh. Okay, then let's see if I can do any better than last time. Let's try to not die at the generator this time. I think I'm going to wait till the end of the round, get like one zombie left, and then just train them around the generator. I feel like that would work a bit better. Uh, now, there is this really cool thing that I found out. I didn't stab before, but when you stab, you get this really cool blood effect on your face, which I think is a really cool feature. Uh, and I also found this change of view thing on this truck over here. I'll just show you really quick. Probably get me killed, but we'll just have a wee look. I haven't bought the M14 yet, but... Look, change it. So now I've got higher FOV, which is awesome. I do personally like to play on a higher FOV if possible. Uh, especially because in zombies it's quite important to see what's in front of you. Now we kind of need that in 14, so I'm going to run back for it. There is double pack punch as well, because you can see on the... Uh, on here... Uh, oh no, it will say double pack punch ammo. Now... Is that a horse? What is that? Dogs? Are they our dogs? We got friendly dogs? Let's quickly do this then. Get our friendly dogs to good use. There's a friendly dog round in this. These power ups are really cool, by the way. I'm pretty sure they're just the dog kill streak from uh, the multiplayer, but still, nice, really cool power up. Quite helpful too for doing these generators. He says as he's about to die. With any luck, that will have done quick revive, which hopefully works as intended. Uh, not how it works, well, not how it works in World at War. <laughs> Hopefully it works how it's supposed to work in single player. Obviously in World at War it didn't work. It only worked the co-op way, so... With any luck, it will actually revive me if I down. If it doesn't, then I'm gonna die. Now we do need to find Juggernog. Um, I don't really know where to go to find Jug, if I'm being honest. I don't even know where any doors are, so... Give me a wee minute and I'll find out where we can go from here. Shitty M14 at the moment. It's been a while since I bought an M14 off the wall though. Like, there's not been M14 in this form in ages. It's a shame Cold War can't bring back some of the old Classico guns. Just in Zombies. They don't have to add it to multiplayer. Just the same guns. They don't even want reskins. They can be the exact same. After such crate. What the fuck? Okay. Is that worth dying for? It really wasn't. At least Quick Revive works. I found 500 points. Yay. The Universal Stella La Pistola. 
Okay, I can now buy Quick Revive back and I've got some USP ammo. Thanks, game. Okay, so if we go that way, hopefully we can find Juggernog. Uh, I don't know if we can, but hopefully we can. Now, we're probably going to run out of Quick Revive now because I decided to kill myself on the fucking searching coin. Maybe I should have waited till the end of the round. But yeah, in World War, you just get two taps so easily. Okay. Okay, come on. Man, the sprinting. Sprinting is so slow. There's a lot of cool little Easter eggs in this map. What is that? Fancy hat? Yeah, we've got a fancy hat on, boys. What is this? That looks like a really weird perk. Is that like lava? I don't know. I assume this is the only way to go. No? Oh, clear the brie. We don't have enough for it yet, but uh, we're going into this thing. This is, looks like a death trap to me. Oh, more crates. Much appreciated. More money, let's go. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> he went flying into the stratosphere. What happened there? Oh, shit, I can't see. Don't be scary. I don't want to jump scare, man. I'm such a pussy. I really don't want to jump scare right now. Cool elevator. Yo, it's already better than uh, Die Rise. How do I call that? Okay, there we go. The elevator's here. Is there anything else in here? Oh. Man, this looks like you're going to die for sure. Oh, MP40. That's good to know. This is like a surefire way to kill yourself. All right. Let's get him far away and then we'll search the crate because they take a while to do. There is three zombies left there. The F button is not working. Wow, it works when he's right on top of me. Quick. Juice. Is this ammo? Man, there's some wacky power-ups, but I like it. Okay, let's go into here. Where do I go from here? Cost 250. Oh, damn, I don't have it. I kind of want to use it, though, so let's kill these lot off and use the elevator. Do we have to kill him? We do. Sad times. New round in an elevator. Let's go. This map has got so much going for it right now. Are we going underground even further? Yes, my visibility shall get worse. Where the fuck am I right now? Why is it so bad? Hang on a minute. Let's just turn up the brightness just a little bit because I can't see. Yeah, sound. Well done. Manual. I'm fucking blind. Okay, ooh. Uh, we'll go there. Now that looks washed out. God damn it. A bit better, a bit better. I couldn't see, man. ACR. Oi, oi, savaloi. More debris here. This is like a catwalk area? Pretty pretty naughty, pretty naughty. What's this? Nothing happens. <laughs> Classic memes from 2008. I don't even think this map's that old, to be honest. Nothing happens. Does anything happen? Probably not. Okay. But it said nothing happens. I'm fucking broken. Oh, shit. Not a good camping area, boys. Not a good uh, little catwalk area. Shitty one, in fact. Because they jump through the fucking ceiling. Come on, do something, button. You want to do something for me? I know you do. I can feel it. This M14 is surprisingly strong, actually. Oh, shit. We're not strong enough for that, though. What the fuck? They're on a madness. Why are they running so fucking fast? Jesus Christ. We are not getting far on this map. It's so big. Well then. It seems to kill and we're still gonna die. What the fuck is going on right now? Let's buy this quick. Get back over here. The ACR from MW3. They do like their MW3 guns, I assume. This is a lot stronger. Can't even get out of here. We're going back up, boys. Fuck this. This is dodgy. We'll come back down here in a little bit. Still looking for Juggernog. We now need Quick Revive again, which is going to be cunt to get. Why well, looks of things? So mainly because I don't know where it is. Please don't be a shit ton of them out here. Where the fuck's Jug, man? It's all I want right now. Ooh, the Spaz. What a great gun that is. Okay. If it's not that way, well, it might be that way, I don't know. This map's fucking huge. The box is over there, for fuck's sake. Jesus Christ. 
Can you even go up here? You can. Golly, this map is big. There is no way in hell I'm going back down there. Because I will die, for sure. Now, I kind of picked the ACR because I thought it would be a pretty good points weapon, but as it turns out, not that great at points. I don't think there's no spawn points behind us, so I don't think there is. Sound like something. Jesus Christ, we do need parts, we need junk especially. You know what, I'm going to leave that for now, because we don't need the 400 points as much as we need to live. Let's get some more quick revive and hopefully not die again to some stupid reasons. So this is our last quick revive already, I believe. Let's just check. No, I can't check. Okay, the fuck? We're gonna buy it anyway. I believe that's it. Will it even disappear? I don't know, maybe not. Hopefully not. Hopefully infinite quick revives because I will need it if I am to survive here. I believe we've already used two quick revives unless I'm on a madness, which I don't think I am. I don't know. I want to go up here, because this is where the mystery box is. I didn't even notice that till now. Uh, that, that was the mystery box. God, this map is big. Look at how big it is! Oh my goodness! The fucking sheer size of this map. The tank. Oh, oh that would have been amazing. Driving around in a tank and zombies. Dragon off. Man, there are so many cool weapons in this. The music's pretty decent as well. This is a top tier map, man. This is like one of the top tier custom zombies maps that I've played. Found the mystery box, nice. Why is there like a tr I, I, I'm not gonna ask questions. Where am I supposed to go in here then? What is the purpose of this? Is this to kill me? What, what is it to do? That's not Jug. God damn it, where's Juggernaut? Give me Jug. Hold on. The right power must be activated first. I think there's a bunch of gen- well, I know there's a bunch of generators, but I wonder if there's a power switch as well. This is a fucking mind fucking a half. This is a maze. Oh, we have to do this generator. Because Jug is up there and we need it. So I'm going to train these lot if I can. Just out of my way. If at all possible, we would be able to do it without dying. Or killing the one zombie that we need to keep alive. Remember then that we'll be able to buy some Juggernog soon. That is top tier. We found Jug. That was the main goal of this round. Now what are the chances that I'm going to actually be able to survive up here without gay zombie spawns and speedy speed boys? To be honest, I don't know. But Juggernog's here, so... Let's go. I'm <laughs> just full eyes off. <laughs> this map is insane for the time, dude. This has got to be like a, a new kind of map. I'm saying like 2018, kind of 2019. Relatively new map, but like on this engine, this is just impressive to me. Okay, we've got two generators done out of four. We're not dead yet, so positives. We've died two times. So we've... Yes, we've lost quick revive there. Probably going to take zombies an age to get there. If, imagine if they spawn in the spawn room and run all the way. Do they actually do that, or is it? Look at the speed on this boy! They're like the Rock Super Sprinters, my dude. They are the Rock Super Sprinters. I played a Rock to know to spot them out of a crowd. I think that's the. Is that the max ammo drop? Unlimited ammo drop. Sorry. Fucking hell. They tried to use the gravity, I didn't even think they had gravity on this. They are coming from every angle, Jesus Christ. Jesus! Now I know why there's so many uh, perks on this map. So with any luck, we'd be left with one that isn't a super sprinter, but they both seem to be super sprinters. So okay, I kind of want to hit the box, I want to see what's in it, to be honest. I also want to explore this area a bit more. I like the fact you don't have to open doors every two minutes, so that's quite nice. You can't get up there, okay. This... Come back later. 
big hit that's going to come out of there, you know? Ooh, Commando. See, I could buy that or I could spin the box. I'm a bit of a gambling man, so I'm probably going to spin the box. Let's go spin the box and see what we can get. I haven't seen any other perks in here, I don't believe, except for that other weird perk down here. I don't know, is that turned on now? Fuck off, the power, the right power, yeah, bastards. Maybe the generators just do the original four perks, because there is four of them. And then there's a secondary power switch. Who knows, MB5K? Nice, you know what, I'll take that. He nearly stuck me there. He nearly stuck me in the corner, okay. Oh well. There's lots of really cool little Easter eggs and stuff as well, so we've got to look out for those. If there is an Easter egg, like a... Activate every generator to open this door. If there is actually like any straight to this map, I'm not gonna be able to do it because it's so fucking big and I can't be asked. And most likely there's not gonna be a guide for it. Okay, so we need to activate all the generators to get into that room. Now I assume that room's got pack punch in it, so I kinda wanna do that. I'm half tempted to go and find another generator, but I have a feeling it's gonna cost me a lot of money. Maybe that generator down below, if there is, is there one down there? I don't know. Let's run all the way back across the map. You really want stamina for this map. For this even bit of the map. Is that a mule kit? The right power must be activated. This CM. This has got MW3 guns in it. I kind of like that. That's a barrier. Shit. Okay. Let's head back down into the catacombs of this base and try to survive. It takes about an age to get there, to be honest. Looking for a power generator. I doubt there's going to be one down here, but you never know. Just hold F on everything, you know. Oh, I didn't actually check out this area fully, so let's have a wee look. The mining shaft. God, this goes a long way. You know what? We'll spend our thousand points on this and hope that there's a generator down here. That's what we're going to do. Another barrier? You're taking the fucking piss, man. Okay. I went wrong. Ooh. Spicy. Satanic ritual sign. Oi oi. The fuck is this place? Satanist headquarters. Um Okay, that's probably there probably is an Easter egg. Look at look at this shit. There there definitely is an Easter egg. Now I'm gonna wait for the visibility to get a bit better so we can see the zombies so we can run past them. So let's get, get him down here and we'll beam past them. Don't wanna take any chances. I want to get to a widened part of the map to start this round because I don't feel like dying right now. We have got Jug, but the, the speed in which they run, like, they're super sprinters. I'm not taking chances. I did see a generator over there, though, which is pretty nice. I think if we go to, like, the spawn area kind of thing, the first generator that we did, uh, generator two, we should be fine. Should be. We'll Sweeney some grenades over there because I can't bother to wait for him. That probably won't kill him. But my, no, my luck, it'll make him into a crawler. Can you even get up there and in there? It's like so many places. Can you get in here? No. Okay. MP5 is actually pretty decent. Normally, I would say this is a point scan, and it is getting us points, but it's not like a down to earth point scan, if you know what I mean, because it still kills them relatively fast. Like, a point scan doesn't kill them, it just gives you a shit ton of points, generally. Hmm, this map's a lot bigger than I had originally imagined, especially with the caves and the fucking castle POW camp looking thing. Massive, massive sight. Gotta respect the creator for making this, for being honest. Very impressive map. Okay, there is more zombie spawns up here. I knew as soon as I opened that door there would be more, but we should be fine for now. It's only like round six and I'm already shit in my pants because I know the fuck. Okay, that ro got, there was one guy running without an arm and he just went round super. There he is. Oh, he's got a sword. Fuck it now. He looked like he had no arm for me. Very good. So there's sword zombies as well as normal zombies as well as super sprinters. There's super sprinters with fucking swords. Look at this guy. He's like tackle. Well, um, never mind, never mind. Okay, we're not grabbing that. That's pointless. 
I reckon we gotta try and do the nether generators. There's got to be so many more better things we can get than just chug and quick arrive. We need stamina. For realism and like realisticness. Don't give me that bullshit about the doctor and pack a punch and shit. Ooh, what's this? Yep, right, power. There's gotta be a secondary switch. Oh, snowman. Yo, we got another fancy hat. Fancy hatception. Let's go. You sass? We'll leave that for now. Okay, this is another generator. Ah, oh, PhD. PhD. Oh, search crate. Hoorah, devil man. You lost fuck it off. And the crate. If I lose any more money, I'm gonna kill your mum. Much appreciated. We lost money and gained money. Let's go. Oh, another crate. And there's a lot of them over here. For fuck's sake. Man. Okay, so I'm guessing stamina speed code is the one you get from this one because the speed code was actually in World at War. We'll get the ACR out because it's more likely to kill than the other fibers. I thought that was Avogadro spawning then, but just the generator will be really good. Yeah, we speed code. Okay, we don't quite have enough for it yet. I kind of want to get it. I don't think we're gonna have enough with four zombies killed either, so that's a shame. Well, at least we know it's there. Go this way? No, you can't go this way. Can you go in here? No, you can't go in here. We need to find the last generator, really. I reckon it's over in the castle area. I don't think there can be much more over here. Surely not. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna get 3k like that either. Okay, can't go down there. I don't think there's any other areas we haven't really explored. <gasps> a flogger trap? That's pretty dope. Now that's towards spawn. Unless there's one in between here and spawn, I don't know. Okay. Then um, I have a feeling there's going to be another one in that castle. Have a sneaking suspicion. I don't really want to kill you here because I will fucking die. Mainly because I've got no ammo, but mainly because I've got... Yeah, mainly because I've got no ammo. Definitely coming back for speed code next round because that's going to be crucial to our survival. Now the only other perk we don't have is double tap. So if we can find double tap, we'll find the other generator. Where the fuck is it though? I reckon it's back up here. And if we go up here, I can also hit the box for a better gun. Because we're, we're lacking on ammo right now. You know what? I may as well keep him until we hit the box. Get 3k. Hopefully find double tap as well. That's got to be the third perk, right? Number one's got number one was joke, number two was quick revival, number four was speed cooler. Where's double tap at? And then maybe in that room you can open the power. I have no fucking clue. It's only like round six and I'm shitting bricks right now. Overthinking this shit. Is it in here? I don't know. What is it? Scar H? Scar L MW three vibes, okay. I hear you, I hear you. At this point, I should just guess MW3 guns because 99.9% .9 of the time I'll get it right. That looks like a power in there. That looks like a power panel. Is this door openable? No. Where's the last fucking thing then, dude? Come back here later. What does it mean by that? Well, it means come back later, dip ass, but where's this last power, man? Don't all the generators we know, or found, sorry. Hmm, interesting. Oh, what about down here? Nope, we've been here. Been here like six times. God damn it. I really don't see it, I'll be honest. Maybe there's something I'm missing. Maybe we need to go back the other way. I'm spending a round out here because this is like the safest place we've got to sit at, so. This does not sound like a scar L, but we move. It's impressive that they've even got into the game in general, to be honest. Maybe it's over here in this section where stamina up is? I don't know, I don't know, but that's the only thing I can really see. I don't know if this is supposed to be a PDW, PDW, POW camp, or a concentration camp. 
Looks to me like a concentration camp. I have seen them and they have like these little huts. A castle, I, did, I didn't see a castle when I was uh, in a concentration camp. But I assume they're basically the same thing. Don't see any gas chambers, so probably a P POW camp. This thing is worse than the ACR, that is not good. Fucking hell. It's only like round seven. Jesus Christ, that's insane. Fair play if anyone can even figure out what to do on this map, let alone go high rounds or something. Jesus Christ, okay, seven zombies left. Okay, nice max ammo. I was hoping that Scarrow would be better, to be honest. Hopefully one of them's not a sprinty boy. But yeah, the rounds got so quick. The 24 zombie cap. Although I don't think it's actually going to be in this map. I don't know. Can you go somewhere else from spawn? I didn't even consider this tool just now. No. No, I'm not being stupid. Okay. So the only other routes where stamina is down here. Let's go down here. I know I was going to buy speed cola, but... I don't want to have to do a bit of exploring first. Do I see it? Is that Peter McCain? Probably not. So this leads just back down here. That's fucking useless then, isn't it? Well, except for opening up a flogger. Hopefully we still have enough points to get speed cola. Okay, we do. Nice. Is it in the satanic room or something? is it man no idea German Shepherd nice maybe you have to open up this door by doing a, a real crouch crouch oh here you go out of bounds glitch <laughs> out of bounds glitch no. <laughs> that's how you get to the last generator you know Hmm. It's got to be the satanic room. I haven't explored that enough, I don't think. Everything else, I feel pretty confident that we've explored to the best of its ability. Or maybe I have to shoot something and unlock something. don't know. I did not see this before. Is this a path? This is not a path. Can I open this? Oh. See, I'm fucking goat at this game. We don't have enough points yet. I don't want to kill the last zombie as well, so... May as well head back to the better area. Okay, next round we're going down there, but I'm not going down there with a shit ton of zombies. There is no way. Okay. If any luck, we get double tap from that, then get into that weird room where hopefully you can turn on the power to get all of the perks to then survive for a longer time, to then get pack a punch. Very complicated stuff. This map is insane though. Again, hard to kill around. Yeah, there is no cap. 28 zombies in a round. Dog, give me the dog power up. Yeah, I shrined it. They're all behind me. I can't outrun them. Maybe I. Oh, wait, no, stamina won't be able to buy. I need to buy stamina when we turn on power, though. Why are my dogs doing jack shit? Okay, we'll, we'll bring one with us. I don't care. We're bringing one. You get really good. You get blessed with the power ups in Modern Warfare, which is lovely, jubbly. I went back to Black Ops 2 and was like, "Whoa, I get so many more power ups." Now, the older games you get so many more power ups, but then I guess in the newer games you get like gobble gums and shit. In the new game, you get your field upgrade and. More perks. I don't know. Anyway, let's go head on down to the satanic ritual area. I don't see there being any other area that has a big enough... Or like any other area with a barrier, even. I haven't seen another barrier wall, but I think I've bought all of them. Satanic ritual! Let's go! Oh, here it is. What the fuck? Is that it?
What do I do now? That's a bit shit. I'm not a Satanist. Maybe it's in that room that says come back at a later time. Hmm. Very interesting stuff. I thought we had that. I thought we were on to a winner winner chicken dinner there, but maybe not. Get out of my fucking way. Jesus. Okay, I have no idea what I've got to do. I'm not. A, I'm not a simp. Uh, I'm not. Not a simp. I'm not a gimp. So I'm not going to search up a guide. Instead, oh, the winter's out. What a weapon. What a machine. What a machine. Oh yeah, baby. This was a fetch quest, and I could not fetch the quest. I'm a bit sad. But we got a winter's house, so all is good. We're not gonna die now. We're basically invincible. Yeah, you're bad. What the fuck? What the fuck was that noise? Jesus, that's got me on the edge of my seat. Jesus. Got no head, you're still chasing after me. Oh, he's a fat cunt. Ah, that dickhead. That's what made that sound. Ah, uh, makes sense now. You know what? <laughs> Bun the wind tower. Let's just buy this dragon off and kill him with this. It's gonna have high damage, surely. <laughs> you good lad? Some guy has some t shitty Tesco mics and decides to scream down the mic for zombie sound effects. This is just ear rape, man. Get a better mic. Jesus Christ. Is it a voice changer or a bad mic? I just can't tell. At first that did have me on the edge of my seat, now it's laughable. What the fuck is this? I'm sorry about the audio guys, it got a bit corrupted. Is this dragon or even killing normal zombies? Let's just check. Ah, it does, it just doesn't. He's got a lot of, a shit ton of health for some reason. Oh, maybe not. Maybe it's shit. Can't tell. Kinda wanna hit the box. The Venom X. How is this in World at War? Jesus Christ. Hopefully we can go this way. Hopefully we can go this way. Nice. Quite a place. This is like a, a ghost's weapon, I'm pretty- This was a ghost weapon? I think it was. Oh my fuck. Mate, it just sounds like the bum hole sounds down your fucking mic. Sounds like you're playing a trumpet without the actual trumpet, it's just like the end of it. God, it, it concussed, man. Get teabagged on, bitch. <laughs> okay, we'll make callers. Nice. Now, I still can't find this fucking thing. <laughs> maybe we go back to the door that said it couldn't be activated at this time. Now we've killed him, maybe. I don't know. I, I, don't, I really don't know. <laughs> Grenade in the hole. 
There's a power switch, so you can see it. I called it. I'm too fucking good. Do I have to do an Easter egg to get this last generator? What do I have to do? I'm tempted to buy that commando on the wall. Tell me you come back later, you bastard. Oh my god, I'm being an idiot. I am being an idiot. People are shouting and screaming at me right now. I need to go downstairs. What a dick. I need to go back down in the elevator. I'm a fucking retard. I just remembered about that whole area. Holy shit. Oh, these are all crawlers. This is going to be easy. I'm such a fucking retard. How did I forget about a whole area of a map? God damn, I'm losing it, man. This quarantine got me tripping balls. Not tripping balls. This quarantine got me uh, depressed as fuck, but... Just thinking about nothing all the time. But I'm now thinking that it's definitely down the fucking hole, man. I didn't even think about down the booty hole where they went fucking fast. And I was like, Jesus. How did I not think? Oh, everywhere. That's the only possible explanation. That's the only place it can be. I know I've said that a few times now, but... If it's not in the Satan's room, it's definitely not up there. Because I've searched about three or four times at this point. And I've completely forgot about here. I'm too scared to go back down here. No, I'm joking. The guy with his shitty mic spawns in. Fucking gone, son. I, I reckon he just... Got bought a Tesco mic, shoved it right in the crevice of his ass, and just farted down it, and that was the sound effect. Pretty shit. Bootable bitch? Parts required that I haven't picked up. Definitely up here. Fuck off. Electric cherry. What the fuck is this? Oh, okay. I just got rid of a good gun. Shit. That's pretty cool, though. I don't like that. Fuck that, I'm turning my sound off. Fucking whisper into my ear, you pussy hole. Oh, this looks sick. It's not It's not whispering anymore. Listen now. Yo, toxicity. Oh, double tap. <gasps> oh, yeah, motherfucker. Don't spawn someone in and kill me. Let's go. This map's actually really good. I'd love to play this with friends. See, this one, I need my friends to get fucking World at War on their PCs. So just refuse. So like, it's a 2 fight in the night game. It's a fucking great game, man. I mean, the mod support is insane. I'm expecting something. I don't know why. sure to give it a like and subscribe to the channel I will definitely be playing this map again someday uh, maybe on stream if you'd like to see it on stream please comment down below if you'd like to see me play this again but damn this map's insane <laughs> can't believe I died.